gather your ingredients. And in this case, for me, it's rice papers. You can find these in the Asian section of your local grocery store. Super cheap. This is 400 grams, which is, I don't know, like a zillion papers. One gram. One piece is nine grams, so math that. I'm not doing it. Um, so it's like three bucks max for the rice paper. You want to have a plate that you have warm water in that you're going to soak the rice paper in. I have vermicelli noodles, which I had to Google how to cook because I had no idea. And all you do is you boil the water, take it off the heat, pop in your noodles, set a timer for five minutes, drain, and then rinse with cold water. Cool. Super simple. I also took some scissors, did a couple of snips in there so they're not ridiculously long. A cucumber, jacama, and tomato. Now, I don't normally cook with jacama, but I thought I'd give it a try. It's uh, something that adds a little bit of a crunch, from what I'm told. I'm using soy curls. I soaked them in water with a little bit of soy sauce. Um, I wasn't too worried about flavor because I'm going to be dipping this business in peanut sauce that I made yesterday. And then uh, this plate is where the finished product will go. Let's do this. Okay. So what I found with rice paper, now if you're not familiar with it, it's pretty stiff. And all you do is you don't crack it like that. All you do is you slip it into the water and you count to 20. And before it's super soft, you want to take it out of the water because the water is sitting on it, so it's actually going to keep getting softer. Now, actually, I meant to grab some lettuce because I've been watching in restaurants that a lot of them, what they do is they start with a bit of lettuce. And that seems to hold all the ingredients together or something, I don't know. So let's put a little bit of noodley business. Maybe I don't want lettuce. I'm going to try it without the lettuce first. Okay, so let's put a little bit of noodles. How much is too much? We'll learn. Let's learn together. And some cucumber. And some jicama. And a bit of tomato. And... Now I think when I did this before, oh, you know what I'm going to add? This is how I cook. I get ideas and I go, ooh, I'm going to put a swipe of General Tsao. Tsao? So, see? Da -ba -da -ba -ba. Franks. Yep. A little bit of flavor. I'm going to put a swipe of that in there. And... Some of my chicken. And then what you do is you pick up the one side. Oh, my counter's dry. Pick up the one side, pick up the other side, roll it over and pull it tight, and then roll it up. Voila! A salad roll. Just like that. Gonna wet that down a little bit. Otherwise, it will stick. All right. Not sure how I feel about without the lettuce. Let's 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 do that again, shall we? I need more water in there. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Yeah, see, 20 seconds? Perfect. Okay, let's try this again. Let's see, maybe if you have flat lettuce. Ooh, there's a nice piece. Okay, let's do that. We'll put that there. We'll put... Some noodles in there. And 
and a swipe of sauce. Some cucumbers, some jicama, some tomato, and some soy. Curls, that is. All right. See, the lettuce is not good. Okay, I don't advise doing the lettuce. No, that barely worked. I'll eat that one. I won't serve that one to the man. Okay. Now, you get to the point where you're getting good enough that you can roll in 20 seconds so you don't need to wait in between. That's the secret. There you go. You have a plate of salad rolls. And that didn't take too long. Uh, I think we're at, what are we at? 15 minutes, all in. Not bad, of course there's prep time on top of that, don't forget, because it is a little piddly when you're cutting all your vegetables and yada yada. But uh, that's pretty much it. And then you can Google online and find yourself a recipe for a peanut sauce, or of course you can buy your own and happily dip your salad rolls. That's it, I'm going to go and enjoy my, uh, my dinner here now. So you have yourself a wonderful day. And hit that like button, comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. Are you going to make this yourself? Um, find me on Instagram and Facebook. I'm accidentally a vegan D. And if you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to comment them down below. You have yourself an amazing rest of the day. Namaste.